we came across an ad for people that were interested in uh, becoming part of the quilt trail. And we thought since we had a business that that would be a good way to advertise the business. We have an actual antique quilt, a family heirloom, that belonged to my grandmother. And when we decided to become part of the quilt trail, Sharon actually came out to design the quilt for us. She wanted to know what kind of a design we wanted on it. And I happened to mention the antique quilt. And she was very interested in seeing it. And when she saw it, she decided that it might be nice to do a crazy quilt because I don't think she'd done one of those before, she said. So she actually used one of the panels from the quilt in her design. We were trying to figure out how to display it, and a lot of people put it on the end of their barn. Well, if we put it on the end of the barn, nobody's going to see it. So the only place that was big enough was to put it over one of our windows. <laughs> but because it was a crazy quilt, we hung it on the diagonal instead of square. People do slow down even if they're not following the trail, because it's right on the front of the barn. So you can't miss it. <laughs> <laughs>